rise and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Not that I wish to imply you have been sleeping on the job. No one is more deserving of a rest, and all the effort in the world would have gone to waste until... Well, let's just say your hour has come again. The right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world. So wake up, Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. had too much time on his hands and now finds time for nothing but the work of salvation. I suspect you have little wish to remain in Ravenholm, so I will show you to the mines. As for me, a shepherd must tend to his flock, especially when they have grown unruly. This is all over. I'm gonna mate. This is bullshit. 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 You are to be commended for avoiding my traps. This is the work of a man who once had too much time on his hands. Now finds time for nothing but the work of salvation. I suspect you have little wish to remain in Ravenholm, so I will show you to the lines. As for me. The shepherd must tend to his flock, especially when they have grown unruly. I got a standard relocation coupon just like everybody else. No! Oh. No! Oh. What you're doing?
Gordon Freeman. This is bullshit. Dr. Freeman. Stay close to me, brother. Attention, residents. Miscount detected in your block. Cooperation with your civil protection team. Permit full ration reward. Run for your life!
It's me, Gordon. Barney from Black Mesa. Gordon Freeman! Sometimes I dream about cheese. Dr. Freeman, can you hear me? Do not go into the light! Although they call me crazy, I care not, for thou art my helper, my strength, and my savior. Man, a few words, aren't you? Judith? What do you think you're doing? No! Through here. Alex, it's Leon, and I've got Gordon Freeman with me. Incoming! Dropship at the lighthouse! It's a dangerous route to my father's lab, through the old canals. Take a look at this, Gordon. Oh, and by the way... Hacks! Blast that little... Where did she get to? Lamar! Come out of there! Uh-oh, everything all right, Dr. Kleiner? Oh, uh, hello, Alex. Well, uh, almost all right. Lamar has gotten out of her crate again. If I didn't know better, I'd suspect Barney of trapping and... My goodness. Gordon Freeman. It really is you, isn't it? I found him wandering around outside. Bit of a troublemaker, isn't he? We owe a great deal to Dr. Freeman, even if trouble does tend to follow in his wake. I must say, Gordon, you come at a very opportune time. Alex has just installed the final piece for our resurrected teleport. I can't take any credit for the breakthrough, Doctor. Nonsense. Your talents surpass your loveliness. <laughs> Let's just see if this thing works, okay? Well, is he here? There you are. Man, Gordon, you stirred up the hive. We can't keep him here long, Doc. It'll jeopardize everything we've worked for. Don't worry. He's coming with me. Uh, that's right, Barney. This is a red-letter day. We'll inaugurate the new teleport with a double transmission. You mean it's working? For real this time? Because I still have nightmares about that cat. No, no. There's nothing to be nervous about. What cat? We've made major strides since then. Major strides. What cat? Doc, since he's not taking the streets, you might as well get him out of his civvies. What? Oh, dear. You're right. I almost forgot. Barney, I'll give you the honor. <laughs> I've got to get back on my shift. But okay. Go. Ah, damn it, get it off me! Lamar, there you are. I thought you got rid of that pest. Certainly not. Never fear, Gordon. She's de-beaked and completely harmless. The worst she might do is attempt to couple with your head. Fruitlessly. Get that thing away from me! Here, yeah, my pet. Hop up. No, not up there! No, no! Careful, Lamar. Those are quite fragile! Oh, fie. It'll be another week before I can coax her out of there. Yeah, longer if we're lucky. <laughs> Barney, you're not an animal person. <sighs> well, Gordon, go ahead. Slip into your suit now. Well, Gordon, I see your HEV suit still fits you like a glove. At least, the glove parts do. I've made a few modifications, but I'll just acquaint you with the essentials. Now, let's see. <clears throat> the Mark V hazardous environment suit has been redesigned for comfort and utility. Oh, dear. Doc, we don't have time for this. At least get that suit juiced up, Gordon. Good idea. There's a charger on the wall. 
I've modified your suit to draw power from combine energy outlets, which are plentiful wherever they patrol. Meanwhile, let's get this show on the road. Position yourself near the panel over there and wait for my work. Is it really? Yes, that yes, time Eli. Again? Bit of a hold up on this end. You'll never guess who found his way into our lab this morning. What, what's going on, Judas? Indeed, it is. And it's our intention to send him packing straight away in the company of your lovely daughter. Are you ready for us, Dad? Shut it down! Shut it down! Then let's do it. Let's see. Massless field flux should self-limit, and I've clamped the manifold parameters to base and LT orbifold. No emergency. Conditions could hardly be more ideal. That's what you said last time. Hey, uh, yeah, about that cat. Initializing in three, two, one. So, fiddlesticks. What now? Uh, Doctor, the plug. Uh, dear me, you're right, Gordon. Would you mind plugging us in? It's right there, Gordon. Excellent. Oh, hey, Gordon. Oh, and before I forget, fuck you!